I'm all about sustainable seafood. So today I'm keen to showcase a delicious product that's caught just behind us and exclusive to WA. It's one of my favourites, the Western Rock Octopus. The Oki we are working with today comes from Fremantle Octopus, an industry leader in this kind of produce. They've basically written a book on how to sustainably fish octopus with their patented trigger trap technology earning the prestigious Marine Stewardship Council Bluefish Tick. We love Fremantle Octopus at Bib and Tucker, and today I'm gonna to show you a really tasty, easy dish you can do at home. We're gonna make miso roasted Fremantle Octopus with a burnt cucumber salad. We're just gonna cook the octopus first. So we put a pan on, and I like to use one litre of water to one kilo of octopus. We're putting some peppercorns, a piece of ginger, and a little bit of Japanese vinegar. And we just bring that to the boil, and then we're gonna pop our octopus in. This will slow it down a little bit, and then it'll take three or four minutes to come up to the boil, and then we turn it down really, really low for about 30 to 40 minutes, so it's just ticking over. That's another thing that's great about Fremantle Octopus is you get a really high yield from it. It really doesn't drop a lot of water compared to a lot of octopus products on the menu that are pumped full of brines and, and waters and things like that. So it's actually great value for money. Now we're just gonna bring together a little salad just to bring this together. We've got one whole cucumber. We're gonna cut in half lengthways, and then just gonna get a little bit of oil and put that straight onto our grill. You could use a barbecue at home. The other half of the cucumber, we're just gonna take the seeds out. And we're gonna lightly salt it for about 10 minutes. And what that does, it just pulls all the juice out of the cucumber and just keeps them really, really crispy. Fremantle Octopus has been presented with many accolades, from the West Australian Good Food Guide Producer of the Year in 2021, to the MSC Best Sustainable Product Australia Award in the same year. These awards are a testament to Fremantle Octopus being the best in the world. The cucumber should be nice and dark now, and we're just gonna bring the rest of the cucumber salad together. So all we do is just squeeze the water out of the cucumber. We add a little bit of our wakame, some toasted sesame seeds, and then the dressing for this is super simple. Just some Japanese vinegar, some sugar, some soy, and a little bit of grapeseed oil. Now to finish this off, we're just gonna add a few chives. It just gives us a nice savory flavor. And our roasted cucumber. Okay, I think this octopus is done. It's looking great. And the way we cleaned it up for the grill is we just take a little bit of the skin off, just the side. You can just peel this skin away. Now we are ready to put it onto our barbecue. We've got our little miso glaze. And all we're gonna do is just brush this onto one side of the octopus and then put it glaze side down. What we're trying to do here is brush the glaze all over it into the tentacles. They really suck up the glaze. We cook it on one side and then we turn it over and then reapply the glaze. We're building up layers of caramelization all around the octopus. There we have it. Fremantle octopus with a charred cucumber salad, sesame and wakame. A locally core product, sustainable, I love it. I know just the place to have it as well. 
Sitting on the WA coast eating octopus is like eating pasta in Rome. It's just something you have to do. 